team. He's a lot easier to tell him. I watched for the linebacker blitz. Will Miller hit the slant. He did good. First draft. He did. Vandenberg on second and ten. Yeah, they've locked on to Moriaki pretty good today. He came in with 23 catches, four touchdowns. 81 up to the right of your screen. Hey, they were locked on to him there. Should yeah. have been holding interference on yeah. David Arnold. Right. Had a hole in the back of his jersey, no flag. It's third and ten. Northwestern with a win will be bowl eligible. Iowa with a loss, still alive for a Big Ten title, but their undefeated season and dreams of a BCS title, possibly, would come to an end as that pass downfield is tipped and incomplete. Johnson Kuliano's down the seam, and it's fourth down and ten. McManus got a hand on it for Northwestern to break it up. They took a shot. Johnson Kuliano's one of their quickest receivers. Vandenberg looked away and then came back. I mean, that's what you have to do. There's um, Mike Hankwitz is the defensive coordinator. Ken O'Keefe, the offensive guy on the other side. Fourth down and ten. Vandenberg. Northwestern had won the three of the last four games and the last two games here on this field between these two teams. It looked in the first five minutes of the game like it might be an Iowa blowout. It was 10 nothing as Kafka takes a knee. He'll have to do it one more time. But then Stancy got hurt on a sack he fumbled the ball in the end zone. It was recovered for a Northwestern touchdown. That changed the game, not just because of the score, but also Stanzi was knocked out because of injury. And the Hawkeyes were never the same. Well, Vandenberg, the rest of the way, went 9 of 27 for 82 yards and an interception. One more snap of the football for Northwestern. Kafka takes a knee, and Northwestern ends Iowa's dream season. The Hawkeyes lose for the first time. Marshall Thomas, today's outstanding player of the game, brought to you by Remax. Two fumble recoveries, including the one in the end zone for the touchdown. As Pat Fitzgerald and Northwestern gets bowl eligible, but more importantly, another undefeated goes down in college football. Iowa still with a shot at a Big Ten championship, but a lot of work to be done, having to go to Columbus next week before wrapping up the regular season at home against Minnesota. Ohio State will play Penn State coming up next over on ABC. At the end of the year, Northwestern for the third time in four years wins at Kinnick Stadium, 17-10 the final.